people you're excited about your business so we got the energy like 100 percent up so let's roll so first number one never miss anything that's right we got caught every trainings monday to saturday monday to friday is to start 9 a.m and saturdays 11 a.m we got trainings every monday to start 6 p.m another trainings every wednesdays and every thursdays so all this all this course is represented by the leaders and founders on the company ceo the important thing the ceo is, is part, you never know when he's going to show out in those trainings and share all these golden nuggets with you so you, that way you can learn more and duplicate all this nobody's going to give you he gives to you for free to me to you we are the, we are blessed with this company and with this uh we all these leaders uh ceo and founders all the speakers who's always teach us how to do the business how to talk to people about pets so that's why never miss anything number two be like one two presentations a day yes it's very important to always practice and yes. remember the practice made the master so we have to do presentations every day share the business share us products and the love that we have to help people and pets at the same time number three free at least 20 minutes a day right now with this amazing technology so you got boring you don't see like pictures in your book or something like that go to the videos go to youtube and things like that get like motivation uh motivation videos like uh, something relate relate with your business with pets let's learn about pets so that's amazing and you will see even you pump it up when you listen like motivation uh, videos like today i was running and i was with my um with my video i've been watching my motivation and i was going and going and i am feeling i feel like oh my god i got the energy and that's what we need okay educate yourself okay number four uh, and don't find that don't say you're not educated okay it's just like the like emotional thing number four call your outline daily yes why because do you call your outline daily he will tell you all the time what you're doing wrong and what you're doing right when you're feeling down he could pull you up when you start believing yourself he always believes in yourself so, yeah, you know what you are here for a reason so I believe in yourself. Why you don't be like the bam, like the bamboo tree, like Mr. The Mr. Doctor here with Doctor, Mr. Andrew Brown say. So I all the time and most of the time when I feel like that way, I always call him and he always pull me up and he's the one with everybody. That's why you have to call your other line all the time because your other line is connecting to your another other line to the founder to the CEO and that's how this works. This is amazing. All right now. Number five, we know to be active uh, 250, right? But like right here, the goal is 700 PV. Yes, that's what we need every month, 700 PV. Number six, always have respect and integrity, integrity for others, for your team, for your family, for your friends, everything, business and life. You not can go out to no work when you don't have respect and integrity for others. Do you not agree how the how the other people think? Please respect. Don't say nothing. I hear and I learn like when I was a little. Do you not have nothing nice to say? Don't say nothing, and don't offend. But that's not true because sometimes when you hit somebody, they will forget. But the words that you say that have coming from your mouth is going to stay here forever. All the time is going to remain all the time. So why not to show respect to others? And that's the same way they will see you. And, and remember, people give to the others what they have. So we have respect, we have integrity right here on this team. I know we do. Let's keep doing like that way. And one thing, this is very, very important, okay? You and I can go out with this number seven in your life. It's always had explosive energy, excitement, enthusiasm we have to have that one because it's not only in business you're not selling the product you're selling yourself a lot of people they uh they buy the products because you because that way that you are because that way that you talk they see how how you do it and they do it so it's not only in that way even in life how you see somebody that you asking them how you doing 
I'm tired. I'm tired. Oh my gosh, you always tired when I'm great. I'm blessed today. I'm still here. I'm alive. So that's what we need, not only online and business. All right. So it's my pleasure right now to introduce the amazing leader, not other than Miss Flinner. Ma'am, please, that floor is yours. Oh my goodness, thank you. I so miss listening to you, Miss Lucy. Um, for those that don't know, probably, you know. She's, she's one of the leaders that have been part of Novetic for quite some time. And so I miss, I, I miss that energy. And sometimes she'd come on Fridays and it was almost like that's, I don't want to say scolding because it was so much more pleasant than that, but she would give us like exactly what we needed to hear, you know? So thank you, Miss Lucy. I love listening to you. It's a pleasure to have you on. Um, so you, what, oh, you bet. Um, and so what I'm bringing you guys today is, is, as you know, we've been doing some product talks you know i've been trying to you know so we do about three products every week now for for our uh, merge alliance i too just like that one well, not a doctor but just like uh, that tectonium a certified vet tech you guys are so i don't know if you know how um i don't want to say lucky because that sounds kind of breaking but you have three of us that are professional pet professionals that that understand the medical side of things please reach out to us as well if you have questions this is what we do this is what we our entire lives are about so um, I kind of joke around with people when I'm not busy helping pets, I'm still busy helping pets. So please, please, please feel free to reach out to us if you guys have any other questions. So um, the first one I'm gonna cover today is, you know, the tried and true, the multivitamin. Our multivitamin guys, I mean, think about it, even the healthiest person you know, even that Olympic athlete, you know what I mean? Mr. America, Dada Van, uh, Van Gura Jr. He takes a multivitamin. And they understand the importance of this. As we know, one of our purposes here with Nevetica is that we are here to bridge that gap because even our bodies weren't meant for processed foods, right? We weren't meant to eat McDonald's every day. We weren't meant to eat, you know, TV dinners. Everything's processed in a can. Our bodies weren't meant for that. Neither are our pets. So we are here to bridge that gap, right? And how easy is this? So I don't know if you guys know, but most of the multivitamins are any, I should say any of the products that Nevetica carries, if you, and again, I've been in this business for 20 years, so I've seen a lot of our competition out there. They're not as edible. Like these are edible. Guys, have you smelled them yet? If you haven't smelled them, please smell them. They smell so good. Um, and so, so to give your dog something that likes in a multivitamin, we are bridging the gap. So anything possible that you can imagine that your dog needs is in this vitamin. Okay. It is in this vitamin. And like I said, so what we're doing with our vitamins, so these support eye health, right? We know that cute little with, with the eyes. Is that, who is that guys? Can you put that in the chat? Who is it that has the, had had amazing uh, results with the eyes? Is it Pol Rolo? Polo. Who is that dog? You guys put in the chat for me. Remind me who it is. Miss Shante Toussaint's dog. Somebody's got to know. Yeah, it's Sphinx. Yes, 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 yes. That's who it is. If you guys haven't seen it, check out the product testimonial page. I do believe Sphinx, I'll have to double check, is also on our uh, Merged Alliance product success page. So if you're not on those, we've got to make sure, especially those the new people that are on this call, reach out to your upline. You want to be on these pages so you can also see and share the results because we all know, right, that, that these stories are selling and that's why. So we like to show why. So not only eye health, heart health, guys, kidney, liver function. We are doing that and providing your pet, providing pets at all ages. So these are safe for puppies post, I believe it's at six weeks of age and up. Um, I might have to check with that as well, but I'm pretty sure it's six weeks and age and up. Uh, multivitamin, the healthiest person you know is on a multivitamin. So this guys is one of those things that even if you, if you cannot, you're having a hard time, um, I don't wanna say sell, you're having a hard time sharing with people, Right. If you're having like, you know, so it's something it's time is it's hard to share certain uh aspects of our uh vitamins. This is or our supplements, this is the one that you want to share. Everybody knows what a multivitamin is. Everybody, I'm guessing 90% of the people you talk to take a multivitamin. If they don't, they know they should be taking a multivitamin. So should your pet, because right, most of them are on processed foods. Another thing that is often I, I love the idea of raw diets for our pets. However, 
the reason a lot of veterinarians are scared of the raw diet is because of um, people not doing it correctly. And so when they don't do it correctly, the dogs and the cats, they're missing, I'm sorry, not the cats, the dogs are missing vital nutrients that they need. So even those, especially, especially those that are on, are on a raw diet need to be on this as well. Okay. So that I'm busy. Nope. I'm busy. And sorry guys. So this is our multivitamin. Again, it's edible. It's yummy. It's a treat. And I'm sure you guys have seen the picture of that of a chewed up container or two of my dogs because they love these. They'll actually unshoe the box. So are there any questions about these at all? I do have you, I do recommend for myself that if a dog is pregnant, that they speak with their veterinarian because this does have calcium in it. And that added calcium might not be something that that dog needs while it's pregnant, specifically while it's carrying. So perhaps after, but that is something that I would recommend that they talk to their veterinarian about first. So any questions regarding the multivitamin? I kind of think that's one of those self-explanatory things. If you guys have your training manual, it's on page 71. I'm gonna try to hold this up so you guys can see. If you don't have a training, look at all of the goodness in there. I know you can't read it. That's a lot of goodness. And then it's probably a lot more goodness than my multi, my daily multivitamin. So, right. So the other thing as well is, so I'm gonna skip to, well, you're right, Mr. Henderson. The problem is, is a lot of the general public don't, I ran into a few people that feel that, um, when they add, let's say green beans, I'm just gonna throw this for example. I had a client who was um, feeding so raw, they thought it was raw. Uh, and they, over there. Okay. Oh, hello? And so they were feeding what they thought was raw and they were adding like canned green beans and canned, and so this dog literally ate either chicken, it was like a chicken or beef and green beans and corn. So they thought they were doing properly, but they weren't. And so this, it was pretty sad to watch this, this dog, um, deteriorate and this was a couple of years ago rapidly deteriorate and I knew um it was just hard it was really hard and they were convinced that they were doing the right thing and yes there's tons of literature that's out there but that is why many veterinarians are going to say eh, I'm not sure but go you know that that's why it, that you see the veterinary community having just kind of a, or I should say that the traditional veterinary community having um that that the blinders on when it comes to raw that's part of it not say it, it's a great diet if you do it correctly. So just to be safe, this is a multivitamin, every dog, love it, love it, love it. Okay, so then we're gonna jump over to, so this is kind of leads into how I was talking about the multivitamin, this poor little dog that I was seeing that was, you know, the diet just deteriorate, deteriorate. Um, and this dog had to be euthanized well before it needed to be because of nutrient, it, it just was like my nutrients. However, I'm gonna now go to our hip and joint. The hip and joint supplement that we have, where did I put it? It comes in two sizes. Well, hello. Um, it comes in two sizes. Now, just because there's, this, this doesn't mean small dog, large dog. It just means, guys, that this one has 30 tablets or chewies. Look at them, tossing them all over, please. And this one comes with 60 chewies. So always, in my opinion, and it's, oh, this one's closed. I don't want to I'll break the seal. In my opinion, this is your better deal. So always, always, always go for this for your, for your, uh, one for your clients. The reason being is because it also helps you, uh, cause you're giving them, you know, it shows you that you, you're out, you're looking out for them. You're giving them a better deal because this, I believe is only $10 more than this. And it gives them twice as much. Okay. So that's a hip and joint. Now, hip and joint is the number one selling supplement in the United States. Why do you think that is? I, I, you know what I mean? It's because we're watching our pets age. They're, they're limping. They're, tell you what, you guys, can you put in the chat for me? What, what do you start to think of when you, when you see a dog that needs hip and joint or has some sort of, can, can you start putting in the chat? Are you seeing pain? Are you seeing stiffness? How about um, having a hard time getting up, right? A lot of times dogs, as they start to feel more painful or more, I should say, more uncomfortable, they're not going to want to eat as much. They start actually even licking their joints or even spots up, you know, let's say their, their, their wrist, it's their wrist is hurting or their high, their knee is hurting, but they can't quite reach it. So they might be licking at their hind, at their, their hip. 
there's a exactly exactly lots of good stuff um as they age you're also going to start to see you know those little old dogs where their butts start getting smaller and their hips get smaller that's because the hips are affected and they're not moving them as much the muscles are getting smaller see biting like in the areas um loss of muscle mass like i just said they can't walk exactly changes in appetite so yes this stuff is great and it helps this stuff helps but let's let's start by giving it to them early on so they don't necessarily get to that point. So some of the things about our hip and joint that are amazing, you guys may have heard already, it has that amazing secret, I call it our secret ingredient because people really haven't heard of it before. And a lot of our competitors out there don't have that. What is best about this is we have Pernican Aliculus. I know it's a hard one to say, and it took me a long time and actually even to be able to speak it on camera, Pernican Aliculus. It's a green lip muscle that comes from, we've gotten it all the way from New Zealand. So this is the cream of the crop. This is the amazing stuff. This also, which a lot of our competitors don't have, it also has the, and I'm gonna hold this up here, the MSM, which has the glucosamine. It has so much amazingness. A lot, if you compare it to, like I said, our competitors, I'm just gonna have to, I'm not gonna. It, it's a great chewy, guys. This chewy is amazing. This is my favorite smelling one. Um, and other people say it's gross, but I love it. But my dogs go crazy and should shake it. Watch them all come in. Okay, nine dogs, nine. So, but what's different about ours is a lot of our competitors are these little chalky, chalky tablets, or there are these big, huge capsules that you can't get your dog to eat them. We can't get her at the vet club. We couldn't get our dogs to eat them. We couldn't, it'd be like, well, here, this is Scott. But here's the other kicker about our stuff, guys, is I have two, personally have two, not my dogs. I have two clients. One is a 13 year old lab, his name is Charlie. Another one is, so he's a yellow lab mix. Woody just turned 14. He's a, he's a chocolate lab that used to walk every day with his mom. Actually he is again. Um, they both, and I'm not, you guys, the veterinary products are amazing. I'm not saying that. I'm just telling you, telling you this is their testimony, okay? Their testimony is, is they were both on different prescription supplements, tip and joint supplements from their veterinarians, different veterinarians. and one, by the way, and I just put it behind me, did you see it? That was pretty impressive, wasn't it? <laughs> so both of them, in fact, one of the vets is actually very interested. She took the canister and was very impressed. So I, he's actually getting, I'm excited. I got to get it out in the mail to him, some of our products. They both started them and they were able to get off of their other products because, well, one, their dogs wouldn't eat the other products within, but one was nine days, one was 10 days. They both got a hold of me and said, Heather, you've got, I'm just floored. Woody, which is the 14 year old lab, is now walking two miles a day with again with his mom. You guys, that's crazy. He's 14 years old. 14. If you, you guys may have seen him on my Facebook page. If you're not friends, if you guys are new and you're not friends with me on Facebook, please reach out to me. Please reach out to me. I love, I love everything in Vetica. Um, and so, and then the other one, Charlie, <laughs> goes, he's able to go up and down the stairs again. He wasn't going up the stairs anymore. So I this is the best stuff out there, guys. It is, I can confidently say that in the 20 years I've been in the veterinary industry, I can confidently say this is the best stuff out there for hip and joint, okay? The next one, um, oh, oh, so you're looking at arthritis, hip dysplasia, uh, and it does large breed dogs. I think German shepherds need to be on hip and joint right away, Rottweilers, uh, golden retrievers, but it's not just for those large breeds. Arthritis hits every dog of every age. Those littles, those little, little, littles, they often have uh, luxidine patella. That's when the kneecap kind of slides out. Just, do any of you guys have any of those? Where sometimes the back leg just won't, won't go back where it's supposed to. Every animal has a hip and joint, has hip and joints. Has, we need, they need to be on this to help lubricate those joints. This is so crucial. So crucial for every pet that's out there. And they love it. They love it. They love it. Okay, the next one I'm going to talk about, I'm trying to make this quick, guys. I'm sorry, I'm talking too long. Our CBD oil. First, I'm going to tell you a testimony about our CBD. Um, I have, a, I don't know if you guys have seen the pictures of Bogey. He is a very, I think he's about nine or 10 now. I'd have to look. Like I said, I have nine dogs. Guys, I'm sorry. It's hard for me to keep track of their birthdays. I'm such a bad mom. Um, but he is a very large dog. I swear I would never have an overweight dog. You know, just because I've been in this industry for so long. He's very large. We're talking like swollen tick, kind of foot ottoman big. Um, I love him but he needs to eat everything, including the cat poop. So I'm so sorry. So we've got it all boarded up. But anyway, 
but part of the reason that he's gained so much weight is is that he was he was so stiff and he was so sore he is on the hip and joint but for him i think a lot of it was muscular as well so it wasn't just in his hips but it was also his muscles you know he's he was carrying a lot of weight he still is he still is. but you guys i started our hip and joint one spray in the morning one spray at night gosh i love this stuff it also has salmon oil in it, which I don't know of any of our competent or competitors that have even come close to this. Um, he's up and he's like, he's running around the yard. I mean, he might be looking for food, but at least he's up and moving. He's running and he's running and he's losing weight. Oh, he used to literally, I, I look over here because this is where he used to sit. He would lay on the ground on the floor or sit there and just whine. Whine. It was this most, oh my gosh, I just had. I just got goosebumps because it was such a pitiful whine because he was in so much pain. He doesn't do that. Anymore. If I miss them, yeah, he does. But this also, so this isn't just, I don't, you know, a lot of people think, oh, arthritis and hips and thighs. This is a whole body sort of discomfort reliever. It's, it also helps with anxiety. Um, I also have a dog that um, my Sadie, my other beagle, she just was diagnosed with mammary cancer and it has metastasized. It was really rapid growing metastasized to her lung, her lungs. And so I've immediately started her back on, on, or started her on the CBD because it also in humans has been shown to help with cancer related symptoms. Um, and most of these studies that I'm talking about are actually in humans. So when you're talking about our CBD oil, you also have to be very careful in what you say, because we're heavily regulated uh, by the Federal Trade Commission about what we can say and what we can't say. So we got to be really careful. But what you can say is, well, in humans, it's been shown to help, you know, with discomforts. In humans, it's been shown to help with cancer, um, nervousness, like overall nervousness, you know, anxiety um, helps elevate the mood. I, I, there's, there's so much more um, joint flexibility, um, promotes relaxation in, in animals. No, it's funny because with Bogey, he's up and moving. But in other animals that have, or I'm just say humans that have had like more, I don't want to say anorexic, but in the, in, in the medical field, anorexia just means lack of, they're not eating. So, so, and pets that are no longer eating as well, um, it is also shown to increase their appetite. So I am so lucky. I got to actually, these are three of my favorite products. Um, do you guys have any questions? Do you have any questions? Um, like I said, feel free, you know, we have Dr. Kroom, Vet Tech Tony. And myself, you know, but a lot of your leaders, please reach out, always reach out because there's so much information that we have and that we are eager to share with you. We also have actually in the works and my goal is to have this up and ready for you. Let's see, it's Monday. My goal is, is going to be April 1st. Does that sound good? We have uh, the leaders and I have been working on a page specifically for pet consultants. So this is once they've signed up and it's an informational page. Now it's not going to take the place of your training manual. Because, and if you don't have that training manual, you guys, everything that I just said is pretty much in that training manual. I've actually broken mine up because I, I use it so often that I had to protect the pages on it. But right. um, you got you got to get into that. So so that's my goal. But stay tuned. You guys will hear more about that in the morning meetings. So any questions? Well, I guess that's a good thing, right? There's no questions. I see Ms. Dickerson smiling at me. Hello. Um, I, I have a quick question. What is, sure. What is it's breaking out. MSM. Oh my gosh. Do you want me to pronounce this? I'm going to try to pronounce it for oh, you. It's pretty, is... it's pretty interesting. Are you ready? It is meth sulfonomethane. And do I know exactly what that is and how it how it relates to joint function? No, but I can find out for you. And maybe Dr. Kroom, if she's on, she might even actually know it. But I do know it's one of the more crucial things. It's that glucosamine, chondritin, the MSM, and of course our awesomeness, pernicant nucleus is more, kind of a standard or should be a standard in anything that is relating to joint care. But I will find out for you and give you, I will send you a message if that sounds good. Okay, sounds good. So, um, okay, with that, I'm going to go ahead and bring up probably one of my most favorite people in the whole world. He has um, not only changed my life, he's changed all of our lives. 
Um, I really, guys, cannot say enough amazingness about him um, to make you feel and feel how much I love him. So Mr. Andre Brown, our founder that we all love and adore, if you guys are not connected to him, you need to get connected to him. He never, you need to get, if you're new and you don't have his number, you need to get it. You need to send him a text message and say, hey, I'm so-and-so, how can you help me? Because <laughs> he's here. He wants to see you succeed. So please, please, please reach out to him. Mr. Andre Brown, the yes, floor is yours. <laughs> yes, man, I, I highly appreciate it. And I'm here to say this, you know, if you feel like your life has changed or right, just wait. Just give yeah. a little bit more time and see what happens, you know? Trust me, mm -hmm. we are just getting started, ladies and gentlemen. We're nowhere near even the starting line as it relates to, you know, how many people's lives we're going to impact and what is that we're doing, how many dogs and, and pets we're going to impact. And so, I mean, as it relates to your personal growth and what you've done, absolutely, Ms. Fleener, I've seen you grow so much as it relates to your speaking ability. Great job, fantastic job. Same with you, Miss Lucy. Thank you for hopping on the call and open up the call with some great excitement, okay? Now, let me share something with you all because I wanna share, and I'm not gonna be too long because we are in the middle of a competition, right? And I don't wanna hold on too long because I know there's a lot of people waiting to win, okay? Um, and so that being said, let me share something with you all. I went on social media the other day and uh, what I saw was um, pretty exciting. You know, I saw this video, it was a gentleman and he was talking about when he met a billionaire. Okay. He was saying, I was driving out to Atlanta, and when I was driving out to Atlantic City, him and his wife, they're big influencers on social media. Okay. They have like 600, 700,000, okay, 600, 700,000 followers. And so they were driving out there, and they wanted to, they figured, hey, since I'm going out, I might as well reach out to this big-time entrepreneur, see if they'll create content with us. You know, what's the harm in at least asking, right? So they decided to shoot the request, and as they're driving out from Philadelphia to Atlanta, the person actually responded back to him. okay? I'm talking about a big time. We're talking about a billionaire, okay? And so they're driving out there, and all of a sudden, the wife gets excited. Oh, my gosh, you can't believe it. He said, what, what, what? Almost crashed. Uh, what, what? What's going on? He responded. They responded. He said they got 15 minutes for us to create some content. Wow, okay? And, hey, you're meeting up with a billionaire, and they came and gave you 15 minutes to actually get together and make it happen. Fantastic, okay? So they said, yes, they connected. Um, he connected her with the PR people. And they set up a date and they set up a time, okay? Um, but they didn't send the address. It wasn't until the day of, like about an hour or so before where they sent the address and they decided to drive up there, okay? And what they realized is they pulled into the neighborhood was it was his house, okay? Now pause. Back when I first met Dr. London, and I realized how much of you know greatness he is as relates to network marketing, what is he can teach in this industry? Um, I remember uh, he came out in Atlanta. I mean, no, first he went to DC. He built a large team out in DC, right? Before he built Nevada He brought in about a hundred something people, right? About 130, 150 people. Then right after this, he drove out to Georgia and built a whole nother team out there in Georgia. Okay. And he said one of the people who he met out there when he drove out there uh, was some big time entrepreneur. Okay. Keep in mind, it's about 2015, 2016 time era. And he said he pulled up to this house as someone that was interested in learning more about the network marketing business. And he couldn't believe what he saw. Okay, first of all, it was like a castle with big old double doors. You had to walk up these steps to get to the door. He said it was beautiful. He opened up the door and all he saw was little kids riding around on the little hoverboards. Y'all remember the hoverboards? Y'all remember that? You know, that was big back then, okay? Well, this family were one of the reasons why the hoverboards came out to America. Okay, and so they were big time entrepreneurs, especially back at that time. The hoverboards were big, and they came into a lot of money. Okay, now pause. He said, when he came into that house, he couldn't believe who the neighbor was. Okay, to show you what type of people that that was around there. You know, when he went to go talk to this person that worked marketing, he said the the neighbor right across the street from him was the person who invented Spanx. Okay, yes. Yes, okay, and she has a billion dollar company, okay? The husband also has a few multi-million dollar companies. And so them together are huge entrepreneur, entrepreneurs. They own professional sports teams, okay? Now, back to the original story. It turns out when they pulled up to that house, that mansion, it happened to be the owner of Spanx, okay? Yes, the same person, okay? 
<laughs> and so they said when they went to the house, they couldn't believe what they saw. The house was amazing. It was humongous. It was huge, you know? And he said, it was so big, you know, it blew my mind. But the fact that this person never met me before and he invited me to his home, it was so humbling, right? But he showed me around the house. I saw the basement. He said his basement had a basement. Okay, meaning when you walk into the basement, it had a gym there, it had a pool table, all this stuff that you go to. And then you had to walk back downstairs again, okay, to go to the second basement, right? He said, I've never seen anything like that before. The basement had a basement, yeah? Now, he said, that was the material thing, though, yeah? He said, however, on the other side, that it's something that he really learned from as he started sitting down and, and talking to him and, and he started talking about things he does around his life, you know, all these type of things. And he said one thing he did was he ran 36,000 miles, okay, within 25 years, okay? And somehow he broke the numbers down and da 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 and it came down to he ran at least four miles a day for the past 25 years, okay? So he had to ask this simple question because he's like, this guy built multiple multi-million dollar companies. You know, his wife has a billion dollar company. They own professional sports teams. He said, how do you have time, right? So he said, how are you so dedicated, right? And disciplined, right? He said, why are you so, how do you get so disciplined to be able to run four miles a day and fit all these things together in what you're doing? He said, never say that word again. He said, wait, what? He said, what? What, discipline? He said, yes, that word right there. Never allowed to come out your mouth again. He said, why? What, what happened? He said, one thing I'll let you know is I'm not disciplined, okay? Discipline means you're sacrificing something that you want to get to an end goal, right? But at the end of the day, no human being is perfect, right? And so there's going to come a time when we break our discipline habits, all right? But let me ask you something. When you wake up in the morning, do you brush your teeth? Uh, yeah. Okay, when you wake up in the morning, you go to bed, do you take a shower? Uh, yes. You ever just decide to go days without brushing your teeth or days without bathing? Uh, no. Well, why not? Um, because it's just something that I, I do, like I just do it. He said, exactly. It's part of your lifestyle. He said, all my habits, what I did was I turned my success habits into a lifestyle. He said, most people, they try to be disciplined or they try to do something for the short term, but they're not willing to what? Make it part of their life, okay? Now, that was just an entrepreneurship period. But let's take that, let's apply it to what it is that we're doing here in the Vedica, ladies and gentlemen. How many of you are really considering yourselves, right? Are a real network marketer, a real Nevedican, where you made it part of your lifestyle, where when you're walking your dog and you see other dogs, you decide to go talk to them. When you're in the grocery store and you're, and you're in the pet aisle and you see somebody else in there, you decide to go talk to them. When you're at the gas station, someone has a nice car next to you, you're not afraid to ask them what they do for a living. When you're on social media versus just scrolling and wasting your time, yes, your time, the most valuable thing that you have in your life. When you're young, you think you got tons of it. But the older you get, the more you realize that that's your most valuable resource. Yes, your time versus going on social media and just wasting your time on entertainment by scrolling, how many are actually using it to profit your business? See, when it becomes a lifestyle, no matter what's happening or what you're going through, it's something within your nature that you're going to make it happen. Well, before you lay down at night, you want to make sure you did something for your business at the end of the day to help it grow. Why? Because it's part of your nature. It's second nature. It's part of something that you do. You don't think twice about brushing your teeth. You can close your eyes and brush your teeth at the same time. You could be in the dark, right? When you can't see anything, you could brush your teeth. Does that make sense? It's second nature. So when it comes to the business, why aren't you the same way? So it needs to become part of your lifestyle. That's how you get to success habits. That's how you go and create billion-dollar success, ladies and gentlemen. And so when we, look, when we look on those lists of individuals that are all the top professional network marketers of 2021, you're looking at those amazing lifestyles, right? Uh, people making anywhere from $30,000, $45,000 a month, all the way up to $1.5, $3 million a month, and the top thousand right i'm talking about the top thousand that's that's a whole lot of people making